So here I am on my way to Maxville. Behind me is Castleman, maybe seven or eight kilometers. Maxville is going to be in that direction, probably about 18 kilometers away. As you can see, it's farmland here. About a kilometer south is the 417, and around me, brand new crops going in for the summer. If you wonder where your dirt comes from, this is where your dirt comes from. Most of it comes from not farmland but swampland that's not really suitable for farming. We also see the uh, Savia Bien LA sign with the rainbow. Those all went up at the beginning of the pandemic and we're still waiting for that to be the case but there you go. Back behind me we have the Petro Canada. And on the other side of the highway there, we have the Tim Hortons. Usually I don't stop at these on the way to Maxville, um, unless uh, it's really windy and hot or whatever. Coming up on St. Elmo. That's St. Elmo up there. And over here, we have the old meeting hall. All right, here we are, arriving at Maxville. All right, so here I am in Maxville, busiest corner of town, the LCBO. <laughs> That's where we buy alcohol here in Ontario. There's looking up the hill, and here's the target of my journey, the bakery. <laughs> this is taking the back way back from Maxville. So we're sort of following the ridge east to west and the reason why I like this ridge is this kind of forest. Okay, so 
so cycling up this dirt road here and uh, what I'm doing mostly today is experimenting with the camera different views different ways of looking at things so this is the uh, Stephen does cycling up a hill section <laughs> apple blossoms kind of in a forested area here and of course, Ontario students will flower all over the place. The trillium. And I don't know if you can hear, but hundreds and hundreds of mosquitoes. Well, doesn't it just figure, eh? I'm standing here. I'm just putting my helmet back on, ready to go, get away from these mosquitoes. And I'm looking at my bike and the tire goes, Guess it was too hot for it. <laughs> so what we've got now is a repair. Okay, well I was gonna go down that road, but fresh gravel means I'm not gonna do it. This is Sanderingham. It's kind of hard to see you with the sun in the background there, but uh, it used to be a school, now it's the Sandringham Social Club, whatever that is. And here we are with flat number two. Looks like it's just the heat. I looked at it and it just sort of burst on the seam. And it was only at 89 pounds pressure, so yeah, I think it's just old tube. But this is a new tube. No, it's another old tube. Oh well. But it's a big tube. It's uh, one meant for a much larger tire. So it's not the right tube, but hopefully it's the tube that gets me home. So back on the road again, just a few kilometers out of Castleman. And once again, the tire just sort of popped on a seam. So it was only 89 pounds pressure, so it's got to be the heat, I figure. Anyhow, almost. And home again. <laughs> Feels good. <laughs> 